Hello, I'm Debbie Morgan, and I'm here again to talk about the number blocks and to do some math um, with you. I wonder if you can guess what the episode I'm going to talk about today. You're right, that was an easy one, wasn't it? I'm going to talk about eight octoblock um, from the number blocks. Hopefully you've watched the episode. If you have, pause the video now and just have a talk to your adult about what you noticed in the episode. Are you back? I bet you had lots of things to talk about. It's a very exciting episode, isn't it? Um, Octoblock does lots of things. Um, he can he can knit super quick. How, why can he knit super quick? You're right, because he's got eight arms. He can cook a banquet with eight meals. Just you might want to later just have a think about all the things that Octoblock can do because he has eight arms and eight blocks. Let's just have a think though about um, Octoblock and the other number blocks. Where does he sit? He sits next to seven, doesn't he, when they line up? Because he's one more than seven. Did you notice in the episode when one jumped really high? She jumped so high that she landed on seven. And what happened? Eight appeared. Octoblock appeared. Here's my octoblock. Um, there with these eight blocks. He appeared because eight is one more than seven. OK, eight comes from seven and one more. Here we've got one. One's having a little game of, of sports day. OK, Octoblock is really good at sports. And together, the number blocks set up um, a sports day together. Number one has made um, a, a high jump that's one block tall. So she's put one block on either side. Let's see if she can jump, shall we? There she goes. She's able to jump over to the other side because she's it's one block tall. Let's have another go. Oh, it's two this time. And two's made his high jump two blocks tall. Let's see if he can jump. Have a go. Try hard to. Oh, there we go. Yes, fantastic. Oh, we've got a long jump. Four's made his long jump four blocks long. Did he jump it? Yes, he did. I wonder what eight is going to do. Can you guess? Yeah, he's going to make a high jump that's eight blocks tall and he's going to make a long, long jump that's not that's eight blocks long. I'm wondering if you want to play that game. I've made one just here. This is one for two for for two to jump over. I've made it two jumps high just with a little um, pencil and some blocks here. And let's see if 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 two blocks, if two can jump over it, shall we? Let's just put two blocks together. They're not the right colour. It doesn't matter. But can I make two jump over it? Here we go. And yes, the other side. I wonder if you want to play that game and make that for your for your number block blocks. Um, or even better, could you go outside in the garden or if you've got some outside space or even in the lounge, could you make um, a little long jump and a high jump using some blocks um, or using some cardboard boxes or anything to make a high jump and to make a long jump? And you might think of some other sports you can do um, as well outside. Let's have a look at these blocks on the screen. Hmm. I'm wondering how many is in each? Do you just want to pause the video and have a look? In particular, I want you to think about which ones have eight and which ones don't. Just pause the video and have a think. Are you back? Did you spot which ones made eight? Um, there, are, there, are, there are some clues, actually. I wonder if you spotted the clues. So there's a clue if we look at this this one here. 
Was that eight? Yes, it was. What, what did you see? I wonder if you spotted one, two, three, four on the top. And also, if there's four on the top, there's four on the bottom. So we've got double four. Double four is eight. If you looked at this one over here, I wonder if you spotted. Oh, that can't be eight. No, because I can see the eight here. I can see the double four. And it's one more, so it's not eight. It's nine. I wonder if you want to explore and, and see how many ways you can put eight together. If you go back and look at the episode, there are some clues in the episode as how many different ways you can put blocks together and how many different ways Octoblock can arrange his blocks um, in different in different shapes. So have a have a go at that. Also look out for when you put your blocks together, what have you got? Can you see a double four in your blocks? I wonder what you can see in this one. Can you see the double three, the six in the middle and two more to make eight? Just have a look at the arrangements and what you can see inside your blocks. Hope you have fun with that. Just a little word to the to the adults before I leave you. Um, what what we're looking at in this episode is obviously eight, but we're also looking at the different ways that eight can be made. Um, that's really good for your child to explore. We're also looking at relationships within eight. The eight is double four, four and four. The eight is also um, six and two more. And looking at the numbers inside eight and the numbers that combine um, to make eight. Have fun. See you soon. Bye bye.